Okay, guys. So, um, we are here on the Majin Buu's Candy Mischief event. Um, I wanted to start it just in the middle, just because um, very rarely have I seen the actual Candy Vegito in the end of it. So, we're going to go ahead and um, go. We're gonna just going to finish this up really quick. So, essentially, on this event, you get a... When you first start off, there is a question mark. And that question mark can either be, from what I've seen so far, either a training item or 777,777 zenny. That's pretty freaking awesome. Um, I'm just bringing random teams here. Whatever is currently available on my friends list, I just select and I go. So there's nothing special about who I'm running. Uh, you don't really need anyone special to run anyway, because this is just a very easy event to beat. You can actually just take your favorite teams if you have any. You don't need OP teams or anything like that. Maybe I'll just make like a Majin Buu SR team with one like SSR leader, just to make sure they're like powerful enough to one-shot them, or at least get them by the end of the first round. Just to have fun, who knows. Um, but yeah, this is freaking uh, pretty damn cool event i really like it it just kind of sucks you have to run it uh 50 freaking times and you're probably gonna want to run it more if you like those with the bora candy items uh, i'm not gonna lie they're freaking it's pretty awesome i just don't know when i'm ever gonna really utilize them i think they were specifically meant for the new super vegeto uh, which does kind of make some sense um all right cool so here we go we're just gonna go ahead because we want to get rid of this as fast as we freaking possibly can um because we're also gonna do a little bit a couple summons so i'm really not too hyped about the new banner um, that's out. I really am not. Uh, the, the LR um, Black and Zamasu banner, I, I think that it's it's kind of crappy. Uh, and I'll tell you why when we get to it, but um, I, I am happy for it. I already saw a couple people on my friends list who have pulled um, Zamasu and Black. Kudos to you guys. Um, I will be do, doing some single summons here. Um, so I'm happy. Yeah, there we go. I just got the freaking um, just completed the uh, Super Vegito, which is awesome. I'm, I'm glad he doesn't dodge. That would have made this event a little bit more of a pain in the butt. I did get my first one on the first run. I'm pretty sure you're guaranteed the Super Vegito on your first run. The other characters that I've encountered were Trunks and Goten. I don't know if it's just going to be between those two or if there's going to be more. So we'll see what happens there. Um, so that's cool. Um, that's that event. Um, you just run it once. There's only one level here. Uh, it's all right. You know, it's nothing, nothing crazy. <laughs> uh, let's go ahead over here real quick. We'll take a look at the mission rewards because I did complete a couple of them. So, let's see, it's going to be underneath the special missions. Majin Buu's Candy Mischief three times. So, that's my third time I just completed it, I believe. So, there we go. Uh, and then, this is a Super Warrior Slime. I haven't completed them because I'm still waiting to get my uh, Bio Broly up to Super Attack 10 with four two pads unlocked. Is that like eight right now or nine? And you have to remember, guys, you have to complete this up to uh, 50 times before it's, you know, before you don't have to run it anymore. Unless you're looking to, like, Either get your Candy Vegito Super Attack 10 with four Dupes unlocked, or if you're just looking to get more of those Deborah cookies. <laughs> so, um, but yeah, that's the only event that's currently available right now. Super Slam's still going on. Again, my weekly grind video will be coming out tomorrow, so I'll let you know what all, all the actual event dates. And everything else is just normal. So we're going over here. This is the um, Legendary Banner, Legendary Summons Banner. So Goku Black's here. Really would like him, don't get me wrong. He's a cool unit. I really love the card art. It's probably one of my favorite card arts in-game. But, look at that. So we have this Trunks. Now, this Trunks isn't bad, actually, because of his passive skill. Attack and defense was 20%. When he Doken Awakens, it's not bad either. I think his attack and defense was 25%. Correct me if I'm wrong. Um, this Vegeta, not really a big fan of him. I mean, he's cool when his passive skill... Because his passive skill is almost always going to go off, so he's going to be a nice little tank when he's, like, awakened and stuff. But, I mean, whatever. This Goku, while he is good, his Doken Wake... Um, I believe this one has a Doken Awakened form. He is just not someone... I, th I think his Dogen Wigan form is attack plus 100%. Um, I, I don't know. I, I don't remember off the top of my head. All I know is that he is not viable if you have all the good, like, strength characters. This is monster is almost never used. This Mai is almost never used. She does have a high chance to stun, but still, I think that's like 50% rate. Um, or that very high chance is over 50%. So yeah, she's probably like about a 50% rate to stun. Still, not an amazing unit. This Trunks is cool when he Doken Awakens, but still not optimal. This Vegeta, he's just outdated. He's so antiquated. The same thing with this Goku. They're just, their nuking passes are just so antiquated, even when you're running them with a freaking nuking lead. Um, hit, cool to have. Again, you're not going to really run him unless you have like a, a Kid Buu team, then possibly, but he's also not like the primary unit you would want to run. Uh, Clone Piccolo, again, I would like some more some dupes of him because I don't have him. I pulled him for the first time. If you guys were watching about a month ago, I pulled him for the first time. Uh, again, I'm not really a big fan of that card. I can I would like one more Weiss because I believe I need one more tech Weiss in order for me to get the last two path unlocked so that way I could just Z Awake or Dogen Awaken him. Um, Beerus, I already have all of, no, actually, no, I think I need like one more of him to get his Z path unlocked. Or, not his Z path, his Dupath path unlocked. 
Um, same thing with this Whis. So, and then we have a couple of SRs on here. So honestly, um, if you pull LR Goku Black, kudos, I'm very happy for you. In terms of the banner, me, like the couple of the Whises, the Trunks and Goku Black are the only ones. I'll only be do, doing single summons here, uh, just because there's no benefit to me doing multi summons on this. And if I happen to pull Goku Black, LR Goku Black in this video, uh, then I won't waste as many stones. Which, again, I don't really see myself doing, but then again, I didn't see myself pulling Majin Vegeta, and I pulled him <laughs> when he had a 0.3%. Um, actually, I did not check to see. Let me go over to uh, the DBC stats page real quick, because uh, it's just quicker. Uh, we're going to go ahead and do another summon. If you guys want to do a summon with me, let me know. Um, well, not let me know. <laughs> um, so we'll, I'll do it um, after this summon. We'll do it together. Um, I, I also just woke up, so I'm, I'm a little bit tired. If you haven't noticed, I have a little bit of a grogginess in my voice. I'm, I'm freaking wiped out. Um, all right. So, I, that's not Majin Vegeta. Oh, look at that ball sack raisin. <laughs> he has a raisin ball sack. Um, okay, so it looks like Majin Vegeta. I, I see a Majin Vegeta on here. I think this is... That's the tech one. Okay, so that's not the right one that I'm looking for. Uh, I'm, I'm over here. We're going to go ahead and do another summon while I'm on this looking it up. Alright guys, so I saw LR Gohan and Broly. So I don't know, I'm pretty sure that Majin Vegeta's on here. I just couldn't see him um, when I was going through the list. So, anyway, we're just going to go ahead and jump into another summon. Uh, maybe we'll get lucky. Maybe I'll get one of the SSRs that I want. Again, I have all of them anyway, except for the Goku Black. So, again, I'm probably just going to go down to 200 stones and I'm just going to save the other 200 for um, the Gogeta banner. And I'll probably do a separate video on that again, um, on who, when I, who I think is going to be on that banner, because I'm pretty sure, uh, I have, I think it's going to wait till Christmas, I think that we're going to have uh, the Gotenks banner and the Bio Broly banner coming up next, and then after that I think we're going to go ahead and have the Gogeta banner for like around Christmas for Dual Doken Fest, and then possibly something else like um, Ultimate Gohan the same month, just so, you know, whatever, we'll see what happens. <laughs> but... Yeah, Super Saiyan 2. We got nothing going on. Next one, we're going to do a group summon. Uh, and we got Krillin. Great. Yeah, he's not doing nothing for me. Uh, There's a whole bunch of Baba fodder right there. All right, so let's get ready. We'll go ahead and do this group summon right now. Uh, we're going to do what we standardly do. 3, 2, 1, then release. All right, two pods. Um, 3, 2, 1, release. All right, Super Saiyan. He's got the Super Saiyan. And we got Super Saiyan 2. And no Super Saiyan 3. Rates over here also are about 0.4 uh, per character. Um, the featured car for the past three hours, Goku Black, is about 0.0486%. Um, it actually looks like he is the primary pulled unit on this of all the SSRs. Average stones per pull is about 1,000 stones, which is, equates to about $500. So he has, yeah, a, almost a 0.5% pull rate, which is really high for an LR. Uh, I don't know when this actually had started. Um, it's, you know, when, when uh, the Laughing Man actually started recording this with the roller. So it could have been any time. But last 15 minutes is 0.631%. So probably has a higher rate. We'll see what happens here. Again, I do like, personally, um, single summons. Uh, let me know what you guys down, pull down in the comments below as well. Uh, I like single summons if there's no benefits to multi-summons. Because, uh, like, you know, getting an Elder Kai or something like that. Just because it's just, the rates fluctuate. So, at least from what I see on uh, Dokkan stats, uh, and if the rates are actually fluctuating, that means at some point you're going to have a higher chance to pull them, and then sometimes you won't. That's the only reason. There's no actual mathematical formula behind it. Uh, plus, if you pull him on, like, in six singles, uh, then you don't have to worry about the last four that you've spent. <laughs> the only thing that stinks is uh, how the, the actual animation uh, behind going through it. There's 18. We don't want you. Get out of here. She's not even, like, an SR-18 where I can feed her into other units. All right, let's see here. Maybe I can get blessed on camera. <laughs> All right, one and one and done, right? Can we get an SSR? I put in what 40 stones so far. Jesus, come on! And that's with what a 11% uh, pull rate overall. Come on. Oh, SR Weiss. No, go away, Weiss. I already have all of you at Super Tech 10. <laughs> that's because of that damn free-to-play Weiss event. All right, we'll do one more. You know what? Don't be surprised if I end up coming back and doing more summons at a later point in time. <laughs> Alright. Last one. Super Saiyan. Got one. 
You got two. You got come on three. No three. Come on SSR. Just give me an SSR. Oh freaking Beerus. That sucks. All right. Well, that's it, guys. That's all I'm going to do for here for now. I have 200 stones. I really don't want to spend them on the Goku Black Banner. As much as I like the card, I mean, I didn't go hard on Super Saiyan 3 Angel Goku just because, I mean, my tech team's awesome, and having him would be freaking, like, really freaking awesome. Don't get me wrong. I really like him. He's an awesome unit. He Between his uh, passive skill and his, uh, well, yeah, his passive skill and his leader ability, he's just a freaking amazing unit. I really would like to have him on my team. But whatever, what can you do, right? I'm not going to be... I'm, I, I don't really think I'm going to go ham on him. I've, I've been going way too ham lately. So I'm just saving my stones for that Gogeta banner. I might do one more set of stones to get me down to 150. Just because we're getting so many stones from the login bonuses. But until then, guys, um, maybe I'll do one in a couple of days. But um, thank you for joining me here today. Make sure to subscribe if you're new. Let me know what you guys pulled down in the comments below. And I'll catch you all later.